in New York book. Let us realize then that this district should also be first on our page as we guide these 9,000 students each and every day. These are the blessings we ask in Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen.
So why would you pick Lakeview of all names that schools that even in the county of Lakeview? So evidently someone told you guys select that name, whatever reason. I mean, it doesn't make any sense. But getting back to Mr. Mountain as I was saying, before he got on school board in, in the early 70s, you know, all the black schools used to get all the hand-me-down, second-hand stuff from Thomas Jefferson. The other wouldn't know what I'm talking about. He knows exactly what I'm talking about. They would get used books, used lab equipment, all of that. I mean, Lincoln had a seashell drive a block not for teachers back in the day. You know what? Well, uptown, he had all nice paid stuff. When Mr. McElroy got on board, he corrected that. He fixed that. You know, if you guys disrespect him like that, it's about in his face. You should be ashamed of yourself for doing that. That man's qualified to have his name put in school, but you pick a lake, you, a school that's not even in the city. I mean, a school's not even located in Lakeview. So basically, I would like to know who came with that bright idea of Lakeview and why did y'all vote on it? I mean, because it makes no sense. Everyone around town is talking about this. I mean, it didn't take no more than a day on the internet for people to start researching and find out what was late doing and, and this, that, and other. I didn't know it was that bad until people sent me messages telling me how they had uh, stuff in their uh, community uh, uh, neighborhood, but they, they, they didn't want uh, Hebrew Israelites to live there. I mean, so the fact that you picked that let me know you didn't do your due diligence in looking up the name. So basically, uh, there's one problem I see with this district. And, and the problem is you don't have any real men running this district. You got a bunch of women walking around wearing pants trying to be men. You can't do that. You got to have a real man running this, running this, this school district. All the administration and most of the women, they're running this. It's like, you don't set no example for men to be men around here. Women running everything. So you curse yourself, you curse your own community by doing that. Go back to that Bible and read what it says about that. Don't take my word for it. Look it up yourself. So you've got one of the lowest academic performing schools in this state. It's a reason for that because you don't respect yourself. You don't respect people in the community. Until you clean up your act, it's going to remain Mr. that way. Your time is up. Thank you very much. Have a Thank nice evening. Next, next, the next speaker is Mr. Julius Lee. Uh, Leo. Next on the agenda is the approval of the minutes of October 25th, 2018. May I have a motion to approve? Motion given. Second, Madam President. Vice President, I'm sorry. Okay. Are there any correction or additions? Are there no correction or addition? I will call for a vote. All in favor say aye. 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 Any opposed? The minutes of October 25th, 2018 are approved with no corrections. Next is the consent agenda. The following items, which are of routine and are of reoccurring nature, have been des designated consent agenda items by the board president per policy BE local. All of the items in the consent agenda will be acted upon by one vote without being discussed separately unless requested by a trustee. In which event the item or items will be withdrawn immediately for the individual consideration. In its normal sequence after the items not requiring separate discussion have been acted upon. Is there any item to be voted on separately? Mr. Vice President, I'm going to ask that items 7 and 8 be pulled from the agenda to be discussed. Seven, seven, seven. 7 and 8 has been pulled. Mr. Vice President, I make the motion that items 1 through 6 and then items 9 through 17 be motioned in. All those in favor of approving the consent agenda specified by saying aye. Aye. Any opposed? Okay, item 7 and 8 has been. I second that motion. Okay, thank you.
call them. One through six has been approved, nine through seventeen. We'll ask for the vote on that right We'll ask for a vote on it. All, in fa all those in favor say aye. 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 Opposed? The aye have it. Mr. Reed, seven, seven has been approved. Item seven, discuss and the possible action to accept one or more application from Motiva Enterprise and or its affiliate for the appraised value limitation of qualified property to authorize the superintendent to review the application for completeness and submit to the comptroller and to authorize the superintendent to enter into any agreement to extend the deadline for the board action beyond 150 days subject to the board ratification. Mr. Vice President, I move to accept the applications for an appraised value limitation on qualified property to authorize the superintendent to review the application for completeness and submit to the comptroller and to authorize the superintendent to enter into any agreement to extend the deadline for board action beyond 150 days subject to board ratification. All those in favor? Madam President, I second it. Okay. All in favor? Aye. 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 Opposed? Item number eight. Discussion and possible action to retain consultants to assist the district in processing the Motiva Enterprise application for appraised value limitation on quali qualified property. Mr. Vice President, I move to retain Moke, Casey, and Associates, and O'Hanlon, Demerit, and Castillo to assist the district in processing the Motiva Enterprise applications for appraised value limitation on qualified property. Mr. Vice President, President, a second. All those in favor of approval of the consent of item eight on the agenda specified by saying aye. 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 Opposed? Personnel, superintendent. Thank you. Board members, you have a copy of the list of um, Personnel items that we would like for you to approve. Ms. Vice President, I move that we uh, approve the employment of teachers as per listed on our agenda. Can I have can I have a second? Second. All those in favor? Aye. 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 All those opposed? Motion passed. Superintendent? Information. Information. Thank you. Average daily enrollment, 8,318. Average daily attendance, 94.5. <coughs> okay. Can I have a motion to adjourn? Motion. Second. <coughs> All in favor? Aye. Aye. Mr. Vice President, before everybody leaves, I'd like to tell the staff and everything, since we will not see you on time after happy Thanksgiving, you guys have a safe and healthy Thanksgiving. Don't need too much turkey. And Mark, not too much cornbread. <laughs> this meeting is adjourned at 710. Thank you. Thank you.